AJ Styles. Ich habe gehört, dass Senita praktisch jeden in der Umkleide gefragt hat, ob er bei seiner neuen Fraktion mitmachen will. Warum zur Hölle wurde ich noch nicht gefragt? Ich war beschäftigt, AJ Styles. Aber ich wollte mich im richtigen Moment noch bei dir melden. Und er ist wohl jetzt. Ist dir der ehemalige Anführer von SOC etwa nicht gut genug, um bei deiner Gruppe mitzumachen? Nein, gar nicht. Wie gesagt, ich hatte nur noch keine Zeit. Nachdem ich offenbar der Letzte bin, den du fragen wolltest, wie wäre es mit einem Last Man Standing Match? Dann zeige ich dir, warum du mich früher hättest fragen sollen. Wenn wir damit diese angeblichen Probleme zwischen uns aus der Welt schaffen, alles klar. Und danach können wir uns vielleicht hinsetzen und uns unterhalten. Klingt phänomenal. Wie ich. Der Mann, den du zuerst hättest fragen sollen. Alter, die Entscheidung ist so schwer. Last Man Standing gegen AJ Styles. Das wird. Oh nee, das wird ein langes Match. A last man standing match. Styles was offended that he wasn't considered to be a part of the former Locks faction. He's rumored to be starting. I haven't been asked either. Don't hold your breath, Byron. And a kick. Take down. Look over the cross face. It's cinched in. This could be over. This will win the match, but it's doing a lot. We're going to free the arm and does just that. into the ring from the floor now. He's rummaging for some sort of equalizer. Whoa! Somersault punch out! Absolutely throwing all caution to the wind. Spitting in the face of danger. Oh my goodness! Don't come over here! Oh, quick! You sassed him with a human shield! And the damage is just going to keep on coming if you can't find the defense for this. Ooh, that got turned around on Styles. He was waiting for him to make his move. And he gets set back into the ring. Oh, oh no! A totally ill-advised decision there. Maybe slight hesitation there caused the outcome. Getting dangerously close to our desk. That's it. I'm out of here. Can't let this 
flourish. Derail it. Holy meet the barricade. Oh, impressive counter. Brief sign of adrenaline there for him. Fight is so close to our announce table. Yeah, I'm just gonna step aside now. Hey, wait for me! Everyone needs to get out of the way of this fight. This feels so unsafe. The body is starting to fail at this point. Yeah, he's got to dig deep and find another win if he wants to stay in this. Oh, man, AJ Styles may be wishing he was back in Japan around now. Styles will rally. Relax. There's a tilt-a-whirl. Backstabber. How effective. Every ounce of momentum is now against him. Yeah, and he keeps struggling to slow the opposition down. There they go. Look out. That was playing with fire and getting burned. The decision Whoa. to take such a risk at this juncture is questionable. Could be some collateral damage on the way here. Everyone needs to clear out, including us. Everyone get out of the way. These two are abandoning all restraints. Seeing an answer for every move attempted. Now draping his opponent over the announce desk. Oh! The announce table was just absolutely decimated. That's how much this match means to them. Nothing and no one is safe. Counted to seven. He stands up and stops the ref's count. You can't keep him down. Coming back in the ring. Slick shot. Forearm smash. That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. And not ready for the bell just yet. So, war die RKOs. Dann muss er doch jetzt fertig sein. Komm. He is rubbing up the engine. He's not going to let anything stop him. Okay, already we get it. Stop looking for adulation for the crowd and get back into the fight. Up to seven now. This could be it. That stops the count, so this match will roll on. Flick shot! Boom! That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. <laughs> Styles has no control here. AJ's gonna slow this momentum down. And well executed move we just saw there. Battling ringside and our announce table's getting shaky. That's because Byron is quivering in fear next to me. Well, I get nervous when the fight comes up here, guys. Control. Oh man, kick to the face. Continues to focus on that region of the body. Shirley is pinpointing that spot. And he's set up for something in the corner. A oh, handspring back elbow. Incredible athleticism. Not done yet. Perched up. Are you kidding me? Wow. Top rope, putting it all on the line. We're gonna finish it off. Tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Okay, already we get it. Stop looking for adulation.
reaction for the crowd and get back into the fight. That's seven. We may be getting to the end. This match isn't over yet. Guess he caught another win. Styles just ragdolled to the outside. No way. Can't stop in the count for some reason. What's that all about? He's not ready for it to be over yet, Cole. We got a long way to go. Reversal. Can he take advantage? Styles is getting dominated. AJ's got to assert himself back in this one. Oh, it's not going to be good. This is not going to be good. The brain buster. Well, this is a warning to grab our stuff and go. Keep it in the ring, please. Saxton's a very fragile boy. He's back into the ring. And stopping the referee's count? That was silly. Either that or it was deliberate. Perhaps looking to make a statement. Sadistic. Reversal. What a counter. He's ejected from the ring. That stops the count there. Better settle in for a long night, Saxton. Throwing salt in the wound now. Oh, no. Crashing hard onto the floor. Taken to the air and completely wiping out. Now, come on. This is just too much. I agree. The ref had already started to count. Oh, a square shot with the back elbows ends that. And now gets tossed into the ring. Incoming! This one is headed outside, guys. Response to AJ there. And he tosses it back in there. Liegen. Jawohl. Oh, ist so. Am liebsten hätte ich zum Beispiel sein Phenomenal Form umgewandelt in einen AKO, aber ich habe keinen Bock, dass der dann hinterher noch trifft oder dass er ihn wirklich noch macht halt, bis er das gemacht hätte.
Okay, das war beeindruckend genug. Gerade mal so. Ich stimme also der lockeren, stressfreien Verpflichtung zu, die du vorgeschlagen hast. Solange du das mit der versprochenen Titelchance deichselst. Das klappt. Aber ich peile noch an meinen Plänen. Ich gebe dir dann Bescheid, wenn du darin vorkommst. Echt jetzt? Ich bereue es jetzt schon. Trotz deiner schlechten Planung und deiner schlechten Entscheidung bei deiner Fraktionsgründung hast du mich in dem Match echt beeindruckt. Ich wäre also bereit, deine Respektlosigkeit zu ignorieren und zusammenzuarbeiten. Cool, aber ich habe mich noch äh, mich immer noch nicht entschieden, wen ich eigentlich nehme. Ernsthaft? Wenn du mich weiter so auf die Folter spannst, bin ich raus. Ich gebe dir bald Bescheid, versprochen. Hey, ich weiß, wir hatten noch nicht viel miteinander zu tun. Ich wollte nur sagen, wundert mich nicht, dass das mit der Evolution nicht geklappt hat und sie dich jetzt wieder ins Visier nehmen. Ich habe am Anfang meiner Karriere was ähnliches mit der ursprünglichen Version durchgemacht. Falls du Mitleid mit mir hast, ich könnte ja Hilfe gegen die Typen brauchen. Nur mal so nebenbei. Haha, <lacht> der war gut. Ich meine das ernst. Oh, manchmal ist das hier schwer zu sagen, aber selbst wenn ich dir helfen wollte... Was ich da irgendwie auch will. Ich bin in Rente. Schon vergessen? Nein, ich weiß. Als noch bei Evolution war, hat Randy mir gesagt, dass du in der WWE nicht mehr mithalten konntest und deswegen nach Hollywood geflohen bist. Und fürs Fall rumsitzen, einen fetten Checkcut zu kassieren. Zitat Ende. Das hat Randy gesagt? Ja, yep. Wenn du Orton das nächste Mal siehst, sag ihm schönen Gruß von mir. In, zw in zwei in Form einer batista bomb Danach reden wir über langfristige Pläne. <lacht> Guardians of the WW Universe. Ja, genau. Weil Batista ja diesen äh, Jet. Äh, äh, wie hieß der nochmal? Dex? Also diesen, diesen muskulösen Typen da spielt. And there you see Evolution's Randy Orton fresh off a momentum building win over Kevin Owens. Oh, ich... Orton's former Evolution teammate. Where'd he come from? These two can't stand each other. This should be good. Taking a look backstage and oh my god, this is a developing situation. Snap suplex. Big elbow drop. Up and down the hard way. Oh, oh, oh gosh. Up and I don't see them getting up after that. And <laughs> with good reason. That <laughs> brawl has. Jetzt wird es noch schwieriger, mich zu entscheiden. Batista wäre eine gute Wahl. Der kennt Randy Orton. Hi Klaus. Ich habe gesehen, was bei Raw passiert ist. Schön, wie du Orten das Maul gestopft hast. Danke, ich muss dir aber was sagen. Was ich dir da erzählt habe, was Orten über dich gesagt hat. Aber erstmal, ich habe nachgedacht und wenn du gerne hättest, dass ich ein kleines Comeback feiere und dir helfe, Evolution zu vermöbeln, dann bin ich dabei, stark. Also was wolltest du mir sagen? 
Nicht so wichtig, ich melde mich. Ah. Funktioniert schon wieder der Bot nicht. Ich kriege die Krise. Und kam bei dir, dann ist mein, dann sind meine Kopfhörer kaputt. Mal wieder. Typisch billig Dinger. So, was hat mit Riddle? Hey, Bro, know you're looking for help, but I'm gonna cut to the chase. You're kind of uptight, and I've already been through that with Randy. No way, Bro, me? Uptight? I'm super cool, so relaxed. We could definitely hang. <coughs> bro? <laughs> okay, Bro, then show me you can let loose by riding a scooter out to your next match while copying my entrance. Do that, then I'll know you can hang. Deal. I just need to borrow your scooter. You don't already have one? I'm having second thoughts. Mine's in the, uh, shop. The scooter repair shop, which is definitely... A real thing. Oh, okay, bro. You can totally bogart mine. Look forward to seeing your goofy side. Okay, jetzt müssen wir das reinkommen, aber... Cool persona and a respected mixed martial arts background. Riddle is here to fight. Wait, that's not Riddle. What the heck is going on here? Uh, I don't know, but he's acting like Riddle, scooter and all. I have no idea why he or anyone for that matter would want to do this. He's actually pretty good on that scooter. Maybe he's been practicing. Is this really the time for goofing off like this? He's got a deadline approaching where he needs to win the championship or he's gone from WWE forever. I think I'd be more focused on that. Or maybe there's more to this we don't know about. Or maybe the stress of the deadline has caused him to lose it. Who knows? He's certainly got Riddle's mannerisms down, Pat. Again, I hate to be the downer, but that's not going to help him win this match, let alone overcome the difficult odds he faces trying to gain Slade's championship before SummerSlam. I just don't get it. And those kids. We've got one of the most outspoken superstars on the roster in the ring right now. Yeah, Cole, he's made it very clear what his intentions are and that no one's going to stop him. Maha. They may be intentions, but only time will tell if he's a man of his word. Hope he isn't getting paid by the hour because Vera Maha is probably looking to make this a quick one. The Lion of WWE has feasted on many an opponent in his young career, clearly staking his claim as a big man on the rise, and very few have been able to stand against him so far. Oh, strong impact! it right back placing them right where they want them into the corner he manages to escape it that's the knee i don't like the look in his eye here folks perched up top a diving knee drop and the lion 
looked more like a house cat there, guys. And Veer's having trouble managing this onslaught. Can Mahan recover from this adversity? Needed a midsection and a kick to the back. Big elbow drop. Staved off that attack. No way. Somersault plancha to the floor. It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. Wow! Great counter-impressive ring IQ on display there. Fear is proving he is not in. Oh, he grew tired of his smug attitude. Just defenseless as the momentum is against him. This is where his fortitude will be put to the test. He got whipped into that corner. Mahan with the reversal. This could be a chance for Mahan to get some distance and rethink things. Kick to the midsection prevents the attack. Dropping the elbow. Top rope, here we go. We're gonna finish it off. Oh, Drew McIntyre. Wow, it is like looking in the mirror. Not sure what you mean by that. I'm just saying our careers have taken a similar course. We both cut our teeth in the international circuit. We both were touted as future champions when we debuted here. We both were let go. And then we both returned and won the championship. Well, you haven't done that part yet. I hadn't really thought about all that, I guess. And I'm working on the championship part. It's actually kind of creepy. Are you intentionally copying me? No, just a coincidence. But we could actually work well together because of everything we have in common. Talking about your new faction, huh? I don't know. Maybe we're too similar to coexist. We might butt heads. We're not that similar. I mean... I didn't go to NXT when I came back to WWE like you did. That's true. I did have a nice run there when I beat Robert Roode for the NXT Championship. Maybe you could prove how different we are by taking on Roode on NXT, but beating him in under five minutes, which is a lot less time than it took me. That's exactly what I was thinking. That is kind of creepy. See? Anyway, give it a go, and we'll talk. From the moment he debuted, this superstar has known how to make an entrance. NXT may be a change of scenery for Robert Roode, the superstar formerly known as The Lock, but the objective remains the same, scoring crucial W. And do it fast. Both competitors will only have five 
minutes to get the job done. Time is certainly running out on the floor. Locks chances at winning a WWE Championship. So the faster the better for this surging superstar. The clock's ticking. Boom! Not done yet. Perched up. Now 450 from the bottom rope. My God. Looking for a high risk move. We're going to finish it off. Catches nothing. Oh, man. Right through to full confidence now. He's letting the WWE fans know it. Go, go, go. Oh, saw it coming. Musst du schnell gehen. I just wanted to say thanks for the apology gift basket you sent New Day. It really meant a lot. No problem. Sorry all that ever happened. All is forgiven. And now that we're on better terms, I was dismayed to see the precarious situation you found yourself in. Is there anything I or the New Day can do to help? Actually, I am looking to start a faction of my own to help get me out of all this. I know you'll always be a part of New Day, but maybe you'd be interested in a dual faction membership? <laughs> I'm intrigued, but we've certainly had our share of ups and downs, mostly downs. The gift basket was nice, but not enough to prove we could work together. Let's team up in a match and see how it goes. Then we'll talk. So essentially a trial period? That works for me. Great. I'll get the faction paperwork started. There's paperwork? Of course not. Just a little faction humor. <laughs> We're gonna have fun. Wolf Woods.
Bet. Of all the superstars I'd have picked to team up with the former Intercontinental Champion, Xavier Woods probably would have been the last. The rumor has it that the pair have mended their fences since that catastrophic WWE 2K cover shoot. But I'll believe it when I see it. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Here's the combo, strikes! Rights and lefts, elbows, knees, all of them lethal. Backstabber! He's absorbed some damage already. If he's smart, he'll make a tag soon. A break on the apron could help him mitigate this damage. Oh! He knows how to avoid contact. And overbearing amount of offense against Eric here. But Eric can't allow this burst to hinder him. of a daredevil, the ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear, absolute reckless abandon. This match is filled out to the ringside area, and as we can see, tension's really running high now. Uh, yeah, we should probably clear the way, guys. Oh. And he's just having his way in this match, keeping the pressure on. Saw that one coming, but Eric has to push. Now, while wow, there's an opening. Completely lost his wind. He can really stand to give back as good as he's getting right about now. Sent into the corner. A oh, handspring back elbow. Incredible athleticism. Not done yet. Perched up. Now 450 from the bottom rope. My God. Habt ihr den Hitler Einzug gesehen? Er ist jetzt offiziell mein Bro. Danke, Bro. Wir hören uns. Kaum jemand weiß es, aber ich durfte die Dusty Classic Trophäe behalten, die ich vor ein paar Jahren gewonnen habe. Ich nutze sie ab und zu als Müslischale. Es ist eine Schande, dass ich nie an einem Turnier teilnehmen durfte, das nach meinem Vater benannt ist. Und eine noch größere Schande, dass sich äh, Super King of Bros über die Trophäe lustig macht. Bro, du kannst jederzeit vorbeikommen und mit mir und der Trophäe abzuhängen. Wir könnten uns doch eine Portion Knusperflocken austeilen. 
Kein Interesse. Wie wäre es stattdessen mit einem Match? Der Sieger bekommt die Trophäe. Das ist eine verrückte Idee, Bro. So verrückt, dass ich begeistert bin. Ich hole mir meinen alten Dusty Classic Partner Butch ins Boot. Wenn du jemanden für dein Team finden kannst... Will jemand? Ich würde dir gerne helfen, die Trophäe zu gewinnen, Cody Rhodes. Wenn du mir im Gegenzug mit etwas anderem hältst, lass uns den Respekt persönlich besprechen. Perfekt, wir schaffen das. Der Albtraum eines Amerikaners. He's dominated the world, and now he's set his sights on WWE. doesn't get much better than what we're about to see as the former Lock and Cody Rhodes team up to take on Riddle and Butch. And the stakes couldn't be more personal. Cody and his partner are fighting to bring home the Dusty Classic Trophy to the Rhodes family's trophy case. Pretty tasty subplot in play, too. Cody could become a powerful ally for the former Lock if he can help lead the American Nightmare to victory. Oh, hard impact in the corner. Catches the leg. Reversal after reversal. These two are ready for each other. Now he's been put on the defensive. What makes a great tag partner, Cole, is knowing when to tag. We'll find out soon enough if he's even a good tag partner. Oh, what a kick. Here's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Double big back body drop. Riddle is fading here. You gotta wonder, what does this do to Riddle's confidence? Inverted atomic drop. Ooh. Oh man, das ist manchmal ein bisschen nervig, wenn man wechseln will, äh, wenn man äh, aufs Seil steigt und dann wechseln wir manchmal. look from Butch. This is a unique application of a hammer lock. What's next? Oh, oh my God, what an arm breaker. <laughs> Wrenching the arm. Uh, 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 all the way down for a European arm breaker. Oh my God, that's gross. Oh, roundhouse kick. Comes in off the tag. He turns it around. And one more reversal. Talk about evenly matched here. Find 
such strength at this stage to kick out that early in the count. He uses an elbow to disrupt that attack. The American Nightmare has crossroads. Riddle might be on Dream Street. needs to cause some separation. And that could be a first step towards Riddle gaining control. But he still has more work to do to get this fully in his favor. He's been placed in the corner now. A oh, handspring back elbow. Incredible athleticism. Not done yet. Burnt stop. Are you kidding me? Whoa. Oh. This is what you call high risk, high reward. Warum? Mach doch den Move, verdammt! Fick dich! Congrats again to Cody Rhodes. 